Well, the machine gun works great. What about other weapons? Vadim, hello. Hello, Alexei. How did the upgrade of weapon systems affect the tank's firepower? The firepower has been increased. This gun is much better at strike accuracy. And now we can use all the advantages of the active armor. The radio set is also state-of-the-art. It allows the crew to communicate at the distance of 20 kilometers. The signal is encrypted. This is not a staged scene, but a real test run with practice firing. The ammunition is real, but it's not equipped with explosive components. Unfortunately, they can't smash a target vehicle. Anyway, we are going to see some shots. So this is the new source in the fire site. Yes, it is. Does it have any peculiar features? I heard it works in several modes, right? Yes, there is a dual plane stabilizing system. It aims optically in the daytime and it has thermal vision for firing at night. The sensors of the Sosna system are put inside an armor housing. The aiming device can lock on a target at the range of five kilometers. Once the target is locked, the system is tracking it automatically. The gunner doesn't take part in the aiming process. If the enemy vehicles go out of optical sight, the thermal camera and the ballistic data computer will pinpoint it, and the laser ranging device will tell us the distance. The classical optical fire sight is still in its place. It could be useful if the complicated electronic system is out. We've loaded a fragmentation round into the chamber. Now we are waiting for a fire signal. Fire! Wow! Awesome! I didn't plan to shout, but it just came out of me. The recoil isn't that big. I was prepared for the worst. Actually, I thought I would be smashed by the breach. Luckily, I wasn't. This gun has two recoil absorbers and a return gear. The firing is disappointingly comfortable. Now Alexei is going to shoot all by himself. And I don't know when exactly it's going to happen. It's much more frightening when it's not you who pulls the trigger. I feel sorry for the target truck. It's not torn to pieces, but completely shot through. Its steel heart will never beat again. Alexei, now you may shoot again. Great. I'm on it. These composite shells are driven to the target by high explosive devices. The bigger the speed, the better the Under Armour capability. The shells have gunpowder cover, which burns out while the projectile is flying to the target. And now it's time to fire a guided missile. Yes, we can fire. I'm locking on the target. Fire! The missile's on. Lock! Hold it! Hold it! A special propelling charge is used to release a missile. Alexei has told me that the main thing is to hold the button until the missile is out of the tube. It's necessary for the automatic system to switch on. After that, you can drive the missile like a pilot. You put the mark on a target and hold it, paying no attention to the tracer. Still holding it. You hit it. Yes. It was sad to say goodbye to this marvelous machine, but the saddest moment was still ahead.